You're watching John G13, it's the weekend and I'm playing some video games, let's go! Ah! So today I'm playing Mario Kart Double Dash, I've been promising this for weeks and weeks and weeks and just not getting around to it. Uh, so today's the day guys, today's the day. I'm gonna beat Mario Kart Double Dash, a game that came out only 18 or so years ago uh, on 150cc and when I say beat, I mean I'm going to get beat by the game. Uh, I don't know, I had to... Um, uh, one of the one of the um, things you got to do to unlock all the tracks is you got to do Star Cup 100cc. I managed to do that first try, but like only just. Like I think I, I, I tied for points, and like when you tie for points with a computer player, like you win. So, <laughs> so it's a little bit hairy, but uh, I think you know I think this is within my abilities. Let's just do this right. 150cc Luigi Circuit. So let's go. Uh, I reckon it'll take about um, like. Uh, 10 minutes of game time per cup. Uh, it's four cups, like a minute or so switch over between races. Uh, this will probably take me about an hour to play through this whole game. So uh, yes, yeah, sit back, sit back and relax and uh, enjoy the game. Uh, I just realized I forgot to, um, to, to move the chat widget. So if you guys start chatting to me, it's gonna cover over the, the part of the uh, heads up display where you see my two, uh, two racers just chilling about. Oh, in fact, I just realized my face. Yeah, I'm gonna move this now. Let's let's do this. <laughs> Look at me flying across the screen. <laughs> um, I really should have uh, should have put a little bit more care into this before I started the stream today, but I actually forgot that. Of course, because I was, I was practicing it in time trials. Okay, back back to it. I was practicing it in time trials, and of course, it doesn't show you your um, the people you're racing against uh, at, the, at the left in time trials. Uh, anyway, yeah, yeah. So some more about uh, what's going on here. I'm playing as um, Co Koopa Trooper and Paratrooper because they, well, a they have the fucking best specials, right? Here. They've got the oh, geez. They've got the triple shell, which is like fucking. If you get the red shell, it's like unstoppable, right? It is like the best special. But second of all, I tried. I tried a whole bunch of because, like, when I used to play this as a kid, I play as um, as pl I play as the Green Dream Team, right? I play as fucking Luigi, Yoshi, Let's Go in the green car, which I haven't actually unlocked yet. I haven't unlocked the green car. Oh no! Well, interestingly, I got a single shell. No, I think that's. I think I just got hit, which is why I lost one of the shells. Yeah. Um. So yeah, green green Luigi car, Luigi Yoshi. But well, one I haven't unlocked the green car. I don't really remember how you unlock it either. I mean, I figure it's just you've got to play enough of the game. But I also thought it'd be cheating if I practiced too much of this. So. Um, but yeah, another one. What is? So I tried uh, I tried doing the the green dream team in the red car, which is Mario's car, and uh, I could not for the life of me win any fucking races in it. Uh, oh, here's me come second in the first race after swimming. I had the red shell there. I should use. I was too busy talking. Um, yeah, uh, I tried. I tried it in the red car, and I was shit. I was like really struggling, and I was like, no, this is mental. I'm gonna try one of the small. So I tried uh, Koopa and Paratrooper in the, um, the 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 shell car and did really well. So yeah, I guess that's that's my new car. That's my new special. My new main. Uh, all right, Peach Beach. Uh, this one like. There's, it's weird, there's like a gimmick at the start of this. You can go left and like lose some time, but like you get a double a double pickup, which I might do on my first lap here. Because, um, well then again, I mean, like, Koopa and Paratrooper specials are only really good for like, if you're stuck behind people, okay, I'm absolutely... Oh, it was only a single, not a double, right, okay. All right, so I've got boosts and a red shell, so I just fire off the red shell. Uh, boosts will be handy for the shortcut coming up here. Um, yeah, this is me doing like a pro strat which has absolutely backfired, and I'm in 7th place. Maybe I'll get some good uh, good item pickups though. Nope, I've got another <laughs> single red shell. Oh man. Yeah, uh, not going all that well so far. Oh, here we go. Got the green shell special. Fortunately, I am like a fucking sniper with the green shells, right? So, uh... Let's get set these for a bit. I'm pretty sure if you go this way, it's a little bit faster, but... Sometimes you get stuck in the water here if you don't boost, which I didn't. <laughs> so, oh man, I'm like losing pretty hard at this. All right, here we go. Stock power. All right, I'll save it for when I'm on the on the straight here. Uh, let's go. Gotta make sure to hit everyone way fast. Oh, oh, perfect. 
As you see, for all that, me boasting about re being a really good shot with a green shell, I missed, and then the computer player hit me, so... And I nearly fucking crashed into the fake item box there as well. Third place isn't terrible, but I would like to win this Grand Prix, and I feel like if I don't win this race, that's kind of... I'm kissing my chances goodbye. Oh, he's got his double special. Oh, this isn't good. Oh, he's got red shell as well. Oh, no, it's not too late. Oh, that's it. I, I get, the, I get the, the special, the triple red shell right at the end there. I feel like um, Bowser beat me last time, right? So that might actually just even out the playing field a wee bit. No, it's not. No, I was wrong. It's one. <laughs> Wario and baby Bowser. What a combination, by the way. Like, look, look at some of these combinations. So it's like, it's adult Bowser and baby Mario. DK and Baby Luigi, fucking Yoshi and Diddy Kong. What? <laughs> why, are they, why are these people cooperating? Why are they cooperating? Ah, oh, whatever. All right, Baby Park. This is like secretly, this is the best track in the whole game because it's just like a complete mess. Um, it's just you go whoop, straight up, straight back, and then that's it. And you do like five times or something. Mario and Daisy. Yeah, that's a weird one. Did I get it? Yeah, I got it. Oh. I shouldn't have said anything about the green shells, because I think I've missed every shot since the one where I said I was a good shot. <laughs> right, I really need to, I need to beat... I need to not only beat these guys in every race coming up, but I kind of need them to, to lose by more than like just a bit at some point as well, in order to actually win this one. Um, I mean, I'm not losing, which is like... I mean, it's better than I expected so far. Oh god. That wasn't good. That's gonna, that's gonna cost me a wee bit of time. Oof. <laughs> I wasn't fast enough. Oh, oh, oh no, oh no. Oh, oh no. <laughs> yeah, everything's gone wrong. Uh, I should get a little bit of a boost there, because I was behind, um, I was behind these guys. No, in fact, no. Oh, looks like Wario and Yoshi. Oh, is this the last lap? No, it's not. Oh, God. Go on. Yeah, yeah. If you fire the um, your green shells or um, what do you call it, uh, the green shells with the bananas directly behind you, when there's a red shell coming up, then it hits it away. Oh god! Oh god! Oh, it's all over, guys! It's all over. Uh, one more lap, but I have a feeling that this isn't gonna go my way. Oh, it's happened again! Oh no! Oh no! Oh, this is what happened to my nightmare last night. I fired up the stream and then came dead last. <laughs> <laughs> no! <laughs> oh my god, sixth place! Sixth place. They they swing in. Um, no. <laughs> Wait, is it Luigi and Peach? It is. Lu it's Luigi and Peach and uh, Daisy and Mario. Here in the, in the deep. Um, oh god. Oh, I love the uh, I love the you didn't do well music. It's just oh no, wah, 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 wah. and then there's like really sad though. Yeah, and the deep Nintendo lore are like are Luigi and Daisy an item? Cause I, mean, I don't know if that's weird. Like a set of brothers and like a set of sisters being like a, a pair of items. I don't know, but yeah, someone someone needs to go and read up on the, on the deep Nintendo lore. Right, well I basically, I've got no chance of winning unless somehow uh, Wario and Yoshi throw away the whole cup. I can still come second as long as I come first or second in this race. Well, as long as I beat um, DK and, um, I think it was DK, no it's Bowser, and, as long as I beat Bowser and Baby Mario, uh, who are currently winning, <laughs> winning, so, you know, that's not great. Um, also, Dry Dry Ride Desert is like a bit of a troll level. Um, Oh, but I do have the trip, trip red shells. This could be a good redemption arc. Right, I'm gonna just sit on these in case this happens. In which case I can just... <laughs> yeah, it's like, this is like the ultimate, like, best item to have if you're in first place because you... Oh, no. Oh, I missed! Alright. Because, yeah, you just every time someone gets ahead of you, you just shoot them down straight away. Um, Right, well, not great, but not terrible. Uh, still in first place, got one red shell and a banana. I, I, I fancy my chances. I fancy my chances at this. I think I can do it. 
Oh yeah, in classic, uh, me being underprepared style, I totally um, went live before even updating the uh, <laughs> description today. So, oh, it's a blue shell. It's a blue shell. Je I mean, I feel like that's kind of just some sums it up. It's like the one time that I'm like winning and way out in front, and if I get hit by a fucking the first blue shell I've seen in the whole cup so far. Um, yeah, I forgot to update the stream description before going live, so everyone would have got a notification today saying that I'm playing Mar <laughs> Mario Odyssey, which I'm not. I, I play Mario Odyssey on weekdays on my lunch break, uh, every weekday on my lunch break, uh, 1 p.m. UK time uh, for half an hour. Um, and yeah, like sometimes I stream at the weekends and do like a little bonus. Like the last one I did was uh, with Mario Party. Oh no, Mario Party 4, which is like that's like a real troll game as well. But uh, I beat it. I won. I beat the computer players, so that was good. Um, and yeah, I've been been wanting, I've been saying I'm gonna do uh, me versus Mario Kart Double Dash on 150 CC for a while, but not quite done it. All right, now it looks like good. Oh, I did it! First place. Uh, <coughs> oh, four races. That's the first one where I finished in first place, so it doesn't really bode well. Uh, that should at least give me the silver trophy for for this for Mushroom Cup then. Oh man. Yeah, I mean, I feel like as a kid I was good at this game because, I mean, through, through sheer like force of will of just playing it over and over and over and over again until I won, just constantly playing the game. Or should we watch the ceremony? I feel like this is a good award ceremony, it's worth watching. It's like all the pianos, it's like, yeah, all the Nokis, yeah. Throwback to those guys from when I was playing Mario Sunshine, which I missed by the way, that game was great. Uh, I had fun playing it apart from the bullshit level. Um, no, I think there's like, yeah, the, the, the hotel level, utter bullshit, and uh, all the rest of the game is like really good. Uh, Alright, so yeah, that's not not great, not terrible. I'll take second place. Second place is, second place is not terrible. Hello, Brewfiend. Uh, you've, you've watched me just get absolutely whooped by Wario and uh, Yoshi, the, the, the yellow, and, yellow and green dream team. Um, a mushroom cup. Uh, <coughs> I have a feeling I'm gonna beat whoever my rival is in the next one though. I've got a good feeling about this. Uh, carrying on with my Koopa Trooper and Paratrooper team. These guys are great. So uh, mushroom cup, done. Silver, silver medal, not great. Uh, flower cup. I picked 150cc right, I'm pretty sure I did. I might be wrong. Uh, flower cup, yeah, yeah, okay. So we got, <laughs> as you can see, I've got, <laughs> I've got the bronze cup from this one already when I was practicing. <laughs> Uh, not great. Daisy Cruiser, I think, is the worst one on this. Uh, Mushroom Bridge is bad as well. Mario Circuit's alright. Waluigi Stadium is tough, so... I don't know. <laughs> we'll see how we get on. We'll see how we get on. Um, <clears throat> I don't know who my rival's gonna be in this. Um, I guess we'll find out after the first race. Uh, let's go! Could be Wario and Bowser. I mean, DK um, <laughs> was no, no. I, was, I keep thinking it was DK, but it wasn't. DK, it was actually Bowser and Baby Mario was like my second rival in the last, last one. Okay, so I'm doing well so far. This game, by the way, absolutely punishes you for not being way out in front, right? If you're um, <laughs> if you're in like second or third or fourth or whatever, you get hit by so many. Oh, sorry, you had one of your comments. Um, why, I wonder why it's not picked. Let's have a look. Ident identity. What? Interesting. <laughs> Hello. Yeah, sorry, the auto moderator picked up your comment there. I'm not really sure why. <laughs> I, I added a permitted term, bishes. Okay. <laughs> you guys are now allowed to say bishes. And the, oh no, and the auto moderator won't pick it up, so that's good. Oh yeah, blue shell. Anyway, yeah, yeah. So like, pretty much the only thing that you can get hit. Oh, shortcut. Oh, it didn't quite work out. Yeah, pretty much the only thing that can uh, derail you when you're way out in front is getting hit by by a blue shell. But it doesn't really cost you that much time getting hit by a blue shell, so it's not not like a huge deal. But if you're in like, if you're in like second or third, you get hit by like approximately six thousand red shells per second, right? You get absolutely ganked by red shells and there's just no escape so yeah it's like if you're if you're winning by a bit the game's really it's like it's like real life right it's like real life rewards you for being rich 
and makes your life a misery when you're poor, right? <laughs> this game absolutely does not look kindly on the middle class, right? If you're in last place, sure, because you get all the you get all the A-list items like the fucking chomp and star power, and uh, <clears throat> what else? Is there, there's no bullet bill in this, although I think the, ch the chomp's quite good. Um, and the lightning as well. You get you get A-list items, whereas if you're right in the middle, you get you get a fucking nothing good, and you're getting hit by all these A-list items. Yeah. All right. So. Uh, Mushroom Bridge, like, historically I've not done particularly well on Mushroom Bridge, so happy to get a win there. You know, I, I feel like this is this is off off to a good start. Uh, I'm feeling much more confident about getting that gold cup this time around. I didn't, do you know what? I had so little interaction with the other racers there, because I just wasn't getting challenged at all. I have no idea who my rival is. It looks like it's DK and Baby, Baby Luigi, so that's an interesting combo. I feel like, um, after... After Mario Kart Double Dash, I think like the next one that came out after this was um, the DS one. It might have actually been the, the Game Boy Advance one, I'm not really sure like the order they came out. But um, I think this was the last one to have it so that you just press A at the right time uh, at the start of the race to get the boost. But I feel like that was a better way, because like in um, in all the subsequent Mario Mario Karts, you've got to- oh no, blue shell. Well at least you got, he's got that as well. You've got to like have the exact num right num like right number of revs uh, when the thing goes off because if you over rev you spin out and die and if you under rev um, you just don't get the boost so it's like you've got to <laughs> you've got to figure out the right time to do it or you've got to start and then just keep an eye on the revs or whatever whereas on this one you've just you've literally just got to boost at exactly the right time I'm gonna sit on this because there's a shortcut right here I'm gonna take hopefully yes wow they must have been. Fucking Bowser and Wario. That's like my two rivals from the last one. They've, they've said, yo, uh, we don't need those other guys. Uh, let's just me and you <laughs> whoop, <laughs> whoop these guys. Um, do you know, I never really thought of like the the implications of uh, Koopa Trooper and Paratrooper firing shells, right? But it's like <laughs> it's like they've captured shells off like their, their compatriots and are just throwing the- oh. Good golly, that is a good combination of items to have at this part of the race. <laughs> Let's go, shortcut again. Uh, red shell again, that's a double red shell. Oh, I wonder if they both hit each other there, or if like, they actually just successfully blocked it. <gasps> Man, the RNG's been really good to me in this race so far. I am digging this. Alright, so yeah, I'll just sit on these red shells until, um, until they get ahead of me again. Uh, and yeah, this time. Yes! No! Oh. oh, I lost all the red shells. I lost... Oh, I didn't realize that was the last lap. <laughs> that was close! <laughs> that was really close. Does it, does it give me a timer there? They beat me but No, I beat them by... Um... By 30... <laughs> 33... One thousandths of a second. I beat them by one thirtieth. Is that right? One thirtieth of a second. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Did it though. All right. So yeah, my main competitors, um, Wario and Bowser. Uh, looks like they've they've usurped. Oh, th this is good because they actually they traded places there, which means I've got like a little a little comfortable buffer there for. Um, uh, the next race, which is Daisy Cruiser, which I am not good at Daisy Cruiser at all. I guess because I always try to go like down below, and there's um, I know cutting it, cutting it really close to the wire there, 33 milliseconds. Um, yeah, there's a there's a bit where you get like um, a double. Oh, I think of the boost. <laughs> For me, complaining. Yeah, that's the first time in like six races I'm not got the boost. But uh, and then there's me complaining about the subsequent Mario games making the boost harder, and then I just missed the boost there. So bad times. Yeah, you can fall down and then you get blasted back up and get a double item box, but I think it's a bit slower, And but I do it every time and I kind of forget what the, I think I'm not going to do it this time and, <clears throat> well I'm in fourth place, yeah. Well no, I'll get, good, I'll get a good item if I do it. This might backfire. Alright, so I've got four red shells. <laughs> that was it. Should be enough to get it in first place, actually. Oh! Oh, I still got hit by it. Damn, that could have gone so well. That would have been perfect. 
All right, I'll probably not bother with that um, <coughs> item box again because like it, it slows you down. It must cost you like a couple of seconds, but like it also it, it reads you as being in a lower place than you are whilst you're at the bottom of the thing, which means that you get like good items. So I don't know. Sometimes it's worth it. Sometimes it's not. My phone's lit up. I, I should really not. <laughs> shouldn't text and drive. <laughs> That's when the bad stuff happens. Uh, I, I was, I was playing. There's a clip of this on my channel, right? I was playing Mario Mario Sunshine uh, on one of the levels where you have to ride the squids. And uh, oh, I thought I hadn't blocked that there. Yeah, one of the ones where you have to ride, do blooper surfing. And I chat. I looked away from the screen for like one second to check chat, and uh, crashed into a wall and died. Like you, you don't, you don't just fall off the blooper surf if you crash. You fucking die, man. The game is merciless. Oh no! Oh no! All right, this isn't okay. <laughs> wow, that was that was extremely lucky. I was in first place, um, <coughs> fucked up and bumped into a pillar, and by doing that, managed to <laughs> lose first place long enough to not get hit by the blue shell. I feel like I'm having stellar luck in this this cup so far. Let's just let's just fuck things up by firing them backwards. All right, we did it. Okay, so. I feel like at this point it would be pretty difficult for me to throw away first place. Um, I'm a solid eight points ahead, <clears throat> um, which would mean yeah, as long as I come sixth place or above, then I'm still first, <laughs> right? So that should be fine, hopefully. Although I think the next one is Waluigi Stadium, so which is like tough. This is like a tough racetrack. So it's all to play for. Um, this is where I choked. Yeah, I don't know if you saw the the, the bronze cup um, when I was selecting the the track just then. Uh, this is where I choked on that playthrough on this track. Uh, I think I came last after having come like third in all the previous. No, actually, <coughs> I'll have been doing well and then come literally like sixth or seventh place in this one. Oh! If you never played Mario Kart Double Dash, by the way. I would say it's probably, it's probably, oh, it's certainly one of the best Mario Kart games. Um, I'm not entirely sure if it's the best, right? Uh, I quite like, I do quite like Mario Kart 8, right? Although I, I begrudge rebuying it on Switch because I bought it on, on Wii U with all the DLCs as well, so like I own the whole game. Um, I think that was a really good Mario Kart. Um, although I, I like this one for like the nostalgia kit. Um, Mario Kart, like, was it Mario Kart um, Nintendo 64? It was like, it, it was noticeably, oh dear. Oh, I'm gonna save this boost because I think there's some good shortcuts coming up. Um, yeah, it's it's noticeably, it's a much older game. It's I mean, it's, it's a good game, but it's old. It's not really aged all that well. Whereas this one, it like feels like you're still just playing like a modern game, I guess. Uh, it doesn't feel dated. Um, well, yeah, I don't know what my favorite Mario, like favorite all-time Mario Kart would be, but possibly this, possibly the um, the DS one, which really good, the, the OG DS one. Um, I never played the 3DS one. Uh, I've heard that's quite good, but like never really, never really played it. Well, never owned it. Um, so I don't know. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I think the DS one is what I played the most of. Yeah, Mario Kart 64. Yeah, I mean. That was one of the first games I ever owned. Uh, it was that and Mario 64. Um, back when I was like, I guess, three or four years old, uh, and I got the Nintendo 64. Um, but yeah, there, there was definitely some rough edges on on Mario uh, Mario Kart 64. I feel like I'm gonna uh, no, I don't want to lose my perfect perfect race streak. I want to beat these guys. Um, oh, this is pretty much it. I think that's the finish line right there. Go on. Oh, well. I'll take second place. Uh, so that that'll bring me. <laughs> that means I get a gold cup for for this this Grand Prix. So that's that's all right. I'll take that. Thirty eight points. I was one off. One off. Perfect. <clears throat> Just that last race there. Uh, I should have probably used the red shell a bit earlier. Um, I wasn't paying enough attention. I was too busy rating, <laughs> ranking my favorite Mario Kart games. All right. It's the award ceremony again. I bet the fucking, I bet the Chucksters are here just to troll me. They're just like, yeah, we remember you, we remember you, we fucking, we threw you off the cliff a whole bunch of times. We threw you to your death.
Oh, I did not even think about playing F-Zero GX. That is a very, very good idea. I'm sorry, I'm just reaching up here. To... I've got it. I've got the disc. I've got F Zero, or the F Zero GX. I could totally. You've just given me the perfect idea for my next bonus stream. All right, I get to put my name entry in. Well, my name is blank, 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 obviously. <laughs> um, yeah, F Zero GX is like. <clears throat> well, I think that's the that is the most recent F Zero game to come out. Uh, I want a gold trophy on Flower Cup. Woo! Oh, I've unlocked the Turbo Birdo. Nice. Yeah. Um. Oh god, the story mode in F Zero GX is incredibly difficult, right? But yeah, that's that's the most recent F Zero game to come out. It came out in what, like 2004 or something. It's like quite old. Um, but I feel like it was the peak of um, <coughs> of F Zero. Um, there's kind of like <coughs> there's a few spiritual successors to like F Zero games. Like um, Fast Racing Neo was really good, but it's missing the 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 rich, rich story and, and, you know, all the other IP stuff that comes from actually being an F-Zero game. Um, but yeah, I feel like however hard Mario Kart Double Dash looks on 150cc, um, F-Zero GX is very difficult because it is so fucking fast, right? It is such a fast, like, you, you just travel, you travel at approximately 6 billion miles an hour, right? It's like, it's tough. That would be good on a, you know, should, what, should we, should we save it, we can save it and then play it in person <coughs> after, uh, after Covid's done with, after, after <laughs> damn it, got frozen. After we can go back to actually, like, meet up, meet up in person. Oh, there's a lot going on in the chat that I want to read, but, like, I'm too busy, like, <laughs> winning, not winning as it happens in this game. Um, this is a new cup, so I need to, I need to re-earn my lead, by the way. Oh, Dear. How'd you how'd you get so many spaces in like uh, star power? Just all right. Huh? <laughs> well, I think you only get star power when you're in like fifth place or last, uh, fifth place to last or something, and they just work their way up to second place. All right. Who's that one in front? It looks like Wario and someone else. As Wario and Luigi. <laughs> They've semi reunited the dream tra dream team from the first one. Instead of it being baby Luigi, it's fully fully grown Luigi this time, so there's that. <coughs> Full size Luigi. Oh. Oh. <laughs> is this the last lap? Yeah. Oh, oh no. Oh. oh no. Oh, this isn't going well. Oh, I need some I need some big ticket items. I need the triple red shell. <coughs> right, right, right now. Oh no. Oh no. Oh, he's throwing it away. Fourth place. Fifth place. For what? <laughs> oh, I'm off to a bad start. Should I just reset? <laughs> Should I just restart this? I could do that. What do we think, boys? Restart it? It's quite hard to come back from starting in fourth place. F. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna, I'm gonna cheat. <laughs> If I click replay, is that let me replay the race or is that showing me the replay of the Oh it's showing me the replay. Yeah. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Alright, what was chat saying? Yeah yeah, we should totally uh, after COVID after we can meet up in person, let's do F C or G yeah. We need four GameCube controllers though. Um so there is that. Um uh, yeah, start up. Okay. Uh, also, the deep James McLeod and Samurai Goro lore. Yeah, you're, you're not wrong. You're not wrong. Um, yeah, F Zero. I mean, that game is like solid gold. Um, all right. Oh, I'm always looking for ideas for uh, games to play on my bonus streams and ordinary lunchtime streams as well. Uh, <clears throat> I'll post uh, after this race if I remember. I'll post the. I've got a survey. Survey Monkey survey open at the moment. Uh, where you can vote, vote for my shortlist for my next game, and suggest suggest games for me to play in future. Uh, the next vote after this one will be a really really big vote because um, I wanted to just um, do like a bit of a, a, a genre a genre change for like my next game because like all my games have been like Mario games so far. Um, but after that, everything's back on the table, so it'll be like a really big vote of like the thirty or so games I've been thinking of, 
Uh, and then I'll just pick like the top four and we'll have like another vote. Because we're, we're a democracy here, we love democracy. <coughs> And also, the election's already been rigged by my uh, good friend, Brun underscore boy. Because he voted twice. Please don't vote twice. We don't like election cheats here. Oh, if you happen to be watching me based in the USA, uh, go and vote. It's, it's time. <laughs> vote. Remember to vote. It's very important for you to exercise your, uh, your right uh, living in a democracy. Doesn't matter who you vote for. I mean, obviously it matters who you vote for, but it doesn't really matter who you vote for. Sorry, I'm concentrating really hard on not throwing my lead to it. <laughs> oh, um, I was, I'm doing much better than I was at the same time in the last race. So this would be the perfect opportunity to get hit by a blue shell or just crash into the ice guy. <gasps> That was close. Still, it looks like I had like a, a solid half second to a second buffer there. <laughs> Let's have a look. Uh, six, 600 milliseconds, yeah, uh, I think. I, I could have been, I could have crashed into another ice guy there and still survived. It's Wario and Baby Mario looks like my uh, rivals this time. Oh yeah, I was gonna post my survey. Uh, what should John G13 play next? Have your say here at SurveyMonkey. Go and vote. <laughs> Go and vote for my next game. It looks like I just crashed the capture card. Oh no. Uh, right, well, I'm gonna have to try and sort this out. <laughs> oh, it's going swimmingly well. Uh, well, it's a good thing I spotted that straight away. All right, well, I can't pause. Oh no, I can. I can pause it. All right. Uh, well, I do have my handy dandy blue screen of death to show you. Uh, you can still hear me, right? Uh, yeah, in the mid, this would be a perfect opportunity. Oh, I can actually just unhide myself as well. Hello, this would be a perfect opportunity for you to go and vote in my not li not rigged election. Um, oh, I actually, it turns out I actually can't uh, mess about with the capture source whilst I'm on this screen. I'm gonna have to do a little bit of a little bit of dicking about with the technology here. Um, yeah, I use a um, sorry. <laughs> Where is it? Um, yeah, there we go. I use a uh, capture card that I got off um, eBay, uh, not eBay, Amazon for not a whole lot of money. Well, wow, this is absolutely <laughs> not working out. <laughs> right, what's going on here? Uh, let's just try. It's a bit of a shame. You have to unplug everything. It's the first time this has actually crashed midstream for me. Uh, I had a crash for me when I was playing Mario Odyssey the other day, but it like crashed before um, before the stream started. Yeah, I'm using this uh, this capture card that I bought off Amazon for about um, I think it was about fifteen or sixteen pounds. Uh, which, if you've never bought a capture card before, is obviously far too cheap for for like an actually good capture card. But it has been, it's been surprisingly reliable so far, and we're back in business by the way, here we go. Uh, it's been surprisingly good so far, I don't know if, yeah, the audio's on as well. Alright, sweet. Surprisingly good so far, I've only had a few hiccups with it, uh, I've only had to show the blue screen of death twice so far. Uh, I should get a counter, but I should get a counter for the number of times that I've had to blue screen. Uh, I've realised right about now that just if you touch it while it's live, um, I think there's some dodgy connection in it somewhere. And that causes it to, to disconnect and got to go and get it. <laughs> we're get back up, it's a bit annoying. Um, I would fork out, I, I had a little look the other day at how much like a, a legit... Oh, I've got four red shells and I'm in second place. Right, well... <laughs> yeah, uh, how do we look at how much like a legit like pro quality capture, capture card would be? Um, like uh, a bunch of my friends have uh, El, El Gato capture card, which is like... I think, I mean, in the UK it costs about 160, maybe 170 pounds, which is it's quite a lot of money. Um, so, I mean, I'm kind of, I'm kind of wanting to just stick, I think I'll just stick with this one and hope that it doesn't cause me too much, too much prob problems going forward. I mean, the other thing is, like, I'm really, I'm happy with the, 
the video quality that I get, it's, obviously it's not as good as you'd get from like a pro, a pro one, but like it's pretty good and for like under 20 pounds as well. Uh, but yeah, my thoughts were I just keep using this one until it just completely dies on me or becomes so unreliable that I can't count on it. And then by that point, obviously, I'll be like a super successful Twitch streamer with over over a million followers by that point. So it'll be like <coughs> like pocket ch <laughs> pocket change for me to go and fork out for a more expensive one. Uh, right, well, I'll, move, I'll go through here the, the double thing. I feel like there must there must, oh, it's not double either. Yeah, I don't know if that one even is a shortcut because you just bash off the sides. I feel like if, if you can just. Um, Steer it without bashing the sides, it's probably faster. Uh, got two green shells, which is good because I could probably protect myself against um, a red. I should should safely win this, unless that happens. Unless I hit the bomb. Uh, okay. Unless I hit the bomb car right here. No, no, we're good. All right, I did it. Well, hey, technical issues can't derail me. They can't stop me, man. <laughs> I'm unstoppable. Uh, I mean, we'll just pretend that I didn't reset this when, <laughs> when I came fourth in the first race. We'll just pretend that never happened, because because it didn't. Absolutely didn't happen. Uh, Yoshi Circuit. All right, this is one of my, <clears throat> this is one of my favorite tracks. Uh, one of the ones I played the most of as a kid. There's a really really good shortcut right at the start that saves you like I don't know two or three seconds if you have a boost, um, which I don't. But. Hmm. Three red shells. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, I missed one. Yeah, fake, fake item box, by the way. Uh, if, if you've not really played that much of this game, fake item block is effectively like not solid, so um, it doesn't block shells or anything. Um, so you can't you can't throw it backwards to deflect a red shell. The red shell just goes right through it, which is a bit weird. Uh, oh, it's blue shell. Yeah, and there's so unlike in in, um, in Mario Kart 8, there's like an item that you can use that um, deflects a blue shell. There is absolutely no way to survive getting hit by a blue shell in this, um, unless someone wants to correct me on that. There might be like a glitch you can do or something. Maybe if you take damage just beforehand, maybe it'll be fine. Oh no! Oh, I went right off the edge. Oh, this could be bad. This could be bad. Uh, like I was saying earlier, once you throw away the lead, uh, this game becomes a lot harder because it's like the, you just get hit by all of the good items that the people at slightly below second and third place get. Um, oh man, I might have just thrown thrown this. I might have just handed um, <laughs> handed DK and Luigi the, the lead. Uh, I feel like they're not my main rivals though. Are they? I, I could be wrong. I might be wrong. All right, well. I'm just gonna have to get good with the, the green shells here, I think. Oh, this could be good. Yeah, no. Actually, I don't think I hit him, I think he just went into the banana. <laughs> Alright, back out in front. So, yeah, this, this could, could be redemption for me falling off the edge there. Green shells, man, I'm just getting all the green shells. Oh, at least I can, at least I can block the red shell. Okay, we're good. Oh, I, I realized that uh, when I'm like getting really into the games, um, I make some I make some questionable noises. <laughs> Something bad happens. Uh, someone got a clip of me uh, on Friday playing playing Mario Odyssey. Uh, I was fighting one of the bosses, and I nearly got hit by something. Uh, ooh, okay, we're good. And um, crap myself, and I was like, ooh, but that uh, was annoying. <laughs> it was pretty bad. Uh, all right, yeah, he's done it. First place. All right, this could be, this could be a perfect, perfect cup. Um, I feel like I might need to go back and get the get the gold cup on um, mushroom cup. What do you think? We'll see. We'll see how we're doing for time after um, after I finish this. I think we've been going for how long? Going for? Let's see. Yeah, we've been going for about forty minutes, <coughs> and this is us like more than halfway through the the. The whole thing. Oh. All right. I don't think there's any good boost shortcuts in this, so I might just, I might just use it as a chance. 
Oh yeah, you can you can uh, choose how far you fly here, but I never really figured out whether it's faster to fly further or, um, or sure. I think it depends on like, how good your acceleration is, because you lose quite a lot of speed. And what happened there? Did I just run into my own shell? Oh, that was unfortunate. Alright. Uh. Yeah, there's a couple of like hairpins on this where if you slightly misjudge it, uh, you, you like you hit the barrier or you fall off the edge and just lose an utterly huge amount of time. Alright! It looks like both of the people in front of me fell off the edge there, so that's good. <laughs> it's worked out pretty well. I'll save the green shells, because that's like um that oh no, that part of the track there is like an absolute killing floor with the um the, the uh, green shells, you just like spam them, because I mean everyone's in a straight line and they can't avoid it, and if they try to uh, like swerve out the way of them, they just go flying off the edge and then that's that, so um, yeah, I'll keep a hold of them and hopefully not get hit by, um, by a blue shell before then. I think, do you know, I've seen um, uh, a second ago that Yoshi Circuit is my favourite, no, I think this is uh, probably my favourite track uh, of the whole game. I love how um, like there's loads of ramps and like bumps and stuff, it was great. Uh, I feel like it's like the most kind of up-down track, apart from maybe Rainbow Road, um, but Rainbow Road's like bullshit. <laughs> it's ridiculous. So, oh, actually no, uh, Wario Wario Coliseum's good as well. Um, that's a good track. Well, I didn't need my um, my trip green shells there because I was way out in front. Um, if I'm still out in front uh, on the bridge on this lap, I'll just like plant them as booby traps just to fuck with everyone that's behind me. Just to, just to ruin their day just a little bit more. Uh, is, I mean, I don't want to jinx it, but like, I feel like I am on track to get the, the perfect, perfect gold on this one. Looks like there's a solid like... Oh, oh man. <laughs> The lightning just kind of derailed me a little bit there. All right, got one green shell, which I'll save just okay, yeah. just in case somebody fires a red shell back at me. All right, we did it, guys! Perfect victory, perfect, no losses at all. <clears throat> is this the one that I reset at the start? I can't even remember anymore. I think it is. <laughs> Well, maybe Sherbet Land. I can't remember. Maybe not. Alright. Oh, thanks for tuning in, uh, Wonderham. Uh, I'll check out who you vote. <laughs> I'll check out what you vote voted for. Yeah, rewrote history, man. Rewrote history. Perfect victory. It definitely didn't come fourth place in the last in the first race of the cup and then reset it. No, absolutely not. Uh, yeah, thanks for taking the time to tune in. Uh, I'll probably be at this. Uh, well, I've got one more, one more cup to do, and then if I'm feeling really good about it, I might try and might try and get the perfect uh, golds across the board and we beat Mushroom Cup. All right, want a gold trophy? I've unlocked the Barrel Train. I mean, that seems like a pretty shit car to be honest. <laughs> um, all right, last one then, last one. Uh, Keeping up with the, the Koopa Dream, Tra the Dream Team. Uh, so we got Wario Coliseum, good track. Dino Jungle, complete troll check. Bowser Castle, I think Bowser Castle's alright. And Rainbow Road is like, obviously Rainbow Road. It's like Rainbow Road. It's in every Mario Kart, and it's always difficult. So, there's that. Uh, this one's quite good though, I like this track. It's got like loads of jumps and stuff. I got a boost, so off to a good start. I mean, we're still a bit huddled together, so I'm not really sure who my main rival is, but I think it looks at the moment like it's going to be Bowser and Luigi. Let's go! Ah! Alright. Come on, three red shells. I should probably actually use them. Uh, yeah, now would be a useful time. All right. How did he avoid that? <laughs> it's got a double hit. Oh man, they are far ahead. I might wait till I'm a bit closer before firing this, or I'll just hit the edge. Oh, I've got two now. I think if I get him just before the jump, that's, uh, there's like a jump at some point. If I get him just before the jump, then uh, that would be really difficult. Uh, really bad for him. 
Go on. Oh, this thing's not trying to jump. Alright, well that's easy enough. <laughs> I'll, just, I'll just take the shortcut. Is that much of a shortcut? I mean, I feel like it's a shortcut if you make it, but if you don't make it... Oh, no! <sighs> oh, that could have been really bad. Yeah, if you get hit with a red shell just as you get to the top of the jump, you lose all your speed and fall to your death, and then have to get picked up by the, uh... Look, 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 I can't remember what it's called. Look, 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 uh, guy. The size of that banana! Yeah, it's like DK's special banana. There's only two laps in this one. Weird. Oh, I guess this is quite a long track. Oh no, I've lost my drift. My messes went up a little bit. You can use, by the way, you can use the bananas as projectiles and you fire them forwards, it's really funny. Uh, right, I'll just set one of these bananas and um, keep it in case in case somebody fires a red shell at me. Green shell for the same purpose. I've, bu I've bunched that corner both times. This gets stuck to the wall. Uh, okay, right. Okay, we're good, we're good. Uh, I'm pretty sure the um, red shell can't, can't do the jumps and they just blow up if, if uh, they, they show up at the boosts. Alright, I just need to not make any stupid mistakes and I've won this, <laughs> right? Yeah, looks like we're good. No! No! <laughs> oh, that. that was, everything's fine. Um, that was a, wow! I still won by a uh, second. That was a little bit closer than I would have liked right at the end. Uh, almost made it away for that blue shell, but not quite. <laughs> Man, it got me right on the finish line. It's brutal. Yeah, Dino Jump. I'm pretty sure this this track's pretty hard. Um, <clears throat> there's like a bit where there's like really thin, uh, thin bridges, and you've got to not fall off the edge. So. I might have to stop talking. Oh no, I missed the boost. I was talking too much and I missed the boost. That's great. Good start, guys. Good start. Uh, it also doesn't help that I don't know this track at all because this wasn't one of the ones that I did when I was practicing. Uh, I seem to remember that. Oh. Yeah, I seem to remember there's three ways you can go there. And like, one of them's faster, but basically completely impossible to do, so I'll just be avoiding that. I'm in last place, guys. I'm in actual stone dead last place. And I missed the shortcut there, I think, as well. Uh, I think you can just cut across the middle there. Maybe you need a boost or something for it. This is what I was talking about, by the way. When you're not in first, you just get hit by everything. Uh, hopefully a good item here, though. Uh, uh, three red shells. Alright, I'll do. Well, I missed one of them. But it's okay because I got picked up by the thing. Oh, I'm gonna get hit by Chump! Am I getting hit by Chump? Oh, I missed that. Alright, we'll get Star Power. Um, there's not really a good opportunity to use Star Power in this level for a bit. I'm just gonna sit on it for a little while uh, and not fall off the edge this time because that's what happened to me last time and it was really bad. Uh, uh, uh. Right, let's. Let's try this. Yeah, I think you need a boost to make that, um, or something that makes you go faster, otherwise it slows you down right at the start. Um, <clears throat> oh, that's good though. Oh, three red shells as well. Okay, could could claw this one back if I don't hit the button. Um, damn, I would have liked to save the uh, red shell there. Oh, I'm gonna... <laughs> I'm gonna, as I was about to say, I'm gonna save that boost. I'm gonna save it. Um, and then got hit by lightning approximately one millisecond later. Right, well, I, I can't really take the shortcut this time. Um, well, I don't risk it. Uh, yeah, I'm just gonna have to get good with the green shells, guys. Three more greens. This could be good. If I get the three reds, no. No, boost them. Uh, nah. <laughs> Not quite. I mean, second place is good. I'll take second. Um, 
I think... Yeah, I think I need to be, like, in at least first or second place going into Rainbow Road, though, because that one is just, like... As I was saying, utter bullshit. Is this the last race? No, it's not the last race. What have we done so far? With the oh, it's Bowser Castle next, right? Yeah, it should be, should be easy enough. I don't really remem remember much about this one, because, like, the Bowser Castle and, like, the Wii one and the Wii U one, they all kind of, like, merge into one level. I don't really remember this. <clears throat> I think there's a bit at the end where if you have a boost, you can, you can skip, like, a hairpin, which is quite good. Um, so I'll try and I'll try and save up the boost. Ah, I've got the three reds, which is good. Uh, yeah, I think th this rings a bell. There's a room with like a spinning. Yeah. Oof. Could be bad. I think um, in the Mario Kart, the Mario Kart, in the N64 Mario Kart, the um, Bowser Castle level is like totally like the best level. Whereas I don't know about this one. It's alright. It's no uh, it's no DK Mountain or Baby Park. Right, well this is the bit where I could take a huge shortcut about a boost, which I don't, so uh, no huge shortcut. Oh I'm straight in the lava, I lost my lost that I lost everything. <laughs> I lost the fucking Did that just quote that just quote a fucking star like the shit star <laughs> fucking phantom minutes. <laughs> oh man. Bad times. Alright, well, blue shell ought to ought to even things up a wee bit. Blue shell and four reds. Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> that'll do. All I need to do is not fall in the lava with my three reds this time, like I did last time. Oh. How's he? Oh, he had so many red shells there. Finished me. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't know if uh, I feel like it's only really um, Koopa and Paratroopa that lose part of their special if they get hit. Like, I'm just trying to think, because if you're Yoshi and you've got the egg and you get hit, you, see, you keep the egg, you don't lose it. Whereas, like, with these guys, you lose two of your shells and you get hit by, like, just anything. Which is a wee bit, a wee bit of shan. Oh, 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 oh. Alright. Well, yeah, if I can keep a hold of the green shell and banana. Oh, I didn't, didn't get a block in. Didn't get the block in and wasted the banana after all that. Bad times. Uh, two greens, yeah, should be, should be safe though. I mean, I could try and use one of them and see if I get the boost uh, for the shortcut at the end. But I, I don't know if you get boosts in first place that much. Which is weird, because it seems like the perfect item um, for if you're in front. Oh. Missed the block again! Uh. Okay, we're good. I feel like they're absolutely breathing down my neck right now. This is a close race. <laughs> this is a close race! Oh no. Uh, right, I right, should have this. Um, oh no. I fell in the lava again. Alright, I'm laying some traps, guys. Laying some traps. Yeah, I think I've got this. And he's done it. Alright, so it's well, just Rainbow Road then. This is this is within my within my abilities as a pro, as a professional Mario Kart Double Dash player. For sure. <laughs> Hopefully. Um yeah, 28 points. I think we got this. Yeah, this is and this is one of the harder Rainbow Roads as well, because there, there's just like, there's a lot of the track that's not got barriers, and there's like hairpins that have um, no barriers right next to them as well. Yeah, like this bit right at the start, where there's the hairpin, there's no, no out of that area. And it's pretty much impossible not to bash the sides at some point. 
Oh yeah, and <laughs> this part coming up as well. I'm just gonna just get into like one solid drift and hopefully not fall off the edge. I think you fall all the way. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's my own fault. I shouldn't drift there. Uh, it's it's always risky. It's always risky to drift at that part of the track. I think. Because like when you hit the hit the boosts, it kind of messes up where you're, where you're aiming as well. Uh, I think it's just like classic classic corner next time. Uh, we're gonna bit we can affect how far we fly. Uh, I think I messed it up there by not landing on the boost, but uh, could be worse. All right, what do you think? Should I try try and get good with the green shells? Should I try and green shell these guys? Try and snipe them. Oh no! Uh, I lost all my items again. <laughs> it's happened again, guys. Oh. Uh, third place should still, by the way, be enough for me to uh, win. Maybe not, actually. I did come second. Uh, earlier. I think I need to beat these guys. Why am I about the red shell there? Just disappear. Alright. Uh, opt in for a simpler strategy here. No drift. Yeah, I think that's probably the toughest part of the, the level for me. Uh, well, I seem to remember as a kid falling off the edge right here quite a lot. Oh, did I just hit my own red shell? All right. Yeah, that'll do. <laughs> that'll do. Alright, well, let's try it. So that's all the way down. So I'm up at the. I should just catch the boost right at the start of it. And I'm like, close. Yeah, I'm having to concentrate real hard. Uh, it's relapsing this, so that's why. Right. Oh. It's a big move for them to put bananas right against the edge, because it's like... Fuck. Oh. Right. It's pretty hard to, um, like, get, once you get pinned to the edge, to, like, adjust your turn so that you're not, like, trapped. Ooh. <laughs> that was hairy. Yeah, getting hit just near the... Sorry. After... Oh, man, I didn't get it. No! Oh. oh, that's bad. It's bad, man. It's bad. Oh, that put me so far back. Oh, have I just lost? Have I just thrown the race away? I can't believe that put me so far back. Oh, man. No. <laughs> oh, it's all going wrong. This is the last lap as well. Alright, well, I definitely need to come above third in order to get the gold. Uh, but I do have a red shell left. Which I'll hopefully not just hit right now. Oh! Oh, I'm in second. Okay. Blue shell would be good right up front, though. From anybody? Oh no! <laughs> second. I think that's enough. I think that's enough for me to get it. I think if you tie, then that gets you. It's not the best way to win gold. Oh no, that's me. I'm ahead. I'm ahead still. Somehow. Oh, I guess it was, um... I guess it was the wrong people. <laughs> the wrong ones that won it. Alright, I was way out ahead. There was no need for me to be stressed there at all. I could have finished in fourth and still got it. We did it, guys! We beat Mario Kart Double Dash 150cc. Alright, should I go back and beat Mushroom Cup again and get the gold? What do we think? What do we think, chat? Cast your votes. No. In the meantime, all right, we got it, guys. The Chucksters are out celebrating. It'd be funny if it was like it was a fake item box right at the start. I don't know. It's right there. Okay, so 150 CC. Do I look in there? Oh, I'll get the credits. I don't remember this. <laughs> Can I skip them? Yes. Thanks for playing. 2003 Nintendo. It's a 17 year old game. Amazing. Alright, well, I've only been at this for about an hour, so yeah, I'll go and do. I'll do. Ooh. Do I unlock something? All tour. Why didn't I just. Um, I didn't realize you could do that. I should have done that. That would have been good. <laughs> All tour cup. 
I don't know. I'd completely forgotten that Ulterior Cup actually existed, so there's that. Uh, yeah, I'll just, um, I'll give it one bash, right? Uh, do or die. Gold or bust, guys. Gold or bust uh, on Mushroom Cup, which I didn't manage to... Have I already got... Yeah, well, anyway. Uh, which is the only one that I didn't manage to get the gold trophy on just then, so I'm gonna get it. Uh, I don't know how I didn't manage to... I must have just been, like, out of practice with it. There's two of them racing in the same car. I feel like that's cheating a wee bit. As in, sorry, there's two... <laughs> there's two sets of racers... Oh! That's the boost. Sets of racers that are using the same low car. Which is like the Mario car. I don't know if it's faster to just cut this corner. It's definitely, at the end, it's faster to cut the corner than it is to get the boosts. Um, but I'm not sure about the... Damn. Oh, yeah, I'm not sure about the, the, about the button. No. Well, it's going a little bit better so far. I feel like I didn't have this kind of commanding lead right at the start of, um, right at the start of today when I was playing. It was a little bit rusty. But now that I've got gold in every cup apart from the easiest cup to get gold. Why? Oh, I missed the, I missed the block again. Alright, looks like it's, uh... Bowser and Diddy Kong's my main rival then. Oh no. Oh man. Oh, oh this is not going well. <laughs> this is not going well one bit. Uh, I can still catch him. I can still do this. I have faith in my ability to get gold. Get gold. We take a moment to appreciate how angry. Oh no! How angry the, the big banana. Yes! Red Shell, come on, come on! Come on, Red Shell! Oh, him over the line. Damn. Well, it's not going great so far. Maybe this is the secret. Secretly, the hardest cup in the game is like. It's Mushroom Cup. Uh, well, I think I need to win every other race then, so it's that. Uh, well, I'll not, I'll not fuck about with the uh, item this time because it just absolutely ruined it for me when I was trying this first time around. I'll not even bother with the shortcut because it's not that good a shortcut. I'm not even sure it is a shortcut. I think I can just go through the shallow water there without getting slowed down at all. Actually, I wonder if it's only when you get like. Deep water, and it's like, oh, fucking blue shell. Yeah, I'm not having a good luck. <laughs> good luck on this one. Although, interestingly, that's um, Wario and Daisy that's all ahead of me. Um, and if Wario and Daisy win uh, with um, whoever it was, Bowser and, Bowser and Diddy Kong in third, that'll still put me back at the first place, I think. Oh man. I should really keep the green shells out so that I'm faster to blow up. Because you've got like switch switch racer and then blast it behind you. Uh well fake item box is like the most useless item in the game, so let's check that. Yeah, so I guess I can just go like right across the middle here. Oh no, okay, that's slow on. Uh fucked up. <laughs> I just see a red shell pop up and then disappear. That could have been bad. Alright, boosts. Right now, boosts is what I want. Boosts? No. <laughs> Three greens, fine. Alright, we're back in business. We're back in business. I think uh, Wario and Daisy might have come second there as well, which would really kind of... Yeah. Well, that makes it a bit easier. So I'm, I'm back to being two points ahead, which is good. So, um... I mean, I think I need to... Well, I don't know. Win one and come second in one. Oh yeah, Baby Park's a bit of a troll then, so that might have been where, where it all went wrong for me last time. I think I came like fourth or something, it was bad. Mm. 
You can totally, by the way, you can totally get hit by the roller coaster when it comes over. Uh, you just need bad timing because it does a little flip there. And um, yeah, if, if you hit it, it just, it, it doesn't, I don't think it kills you or anything, but it like slows you down and it bumps you backwards. What? <laughs> nearly happened. Oh. That's interesting. I wonder if Wario and Daisy are actually my main rivals, but like, they just messed up the first race. Oh. That I think that red shell just changed who it was going for there. I mean, I'm not complaining, it's quite lucky. Oh, I fucked it. Man, you lose so, so much time if you mess up the, um, like, get the effects in the turn just there. It's kind of a wee bit hairy. Oh, all right, is that it? Okay, that, I mean that should give me a comfortable lead going into um, whatever the last track is, which I don't remember. Even though I did this like what forty minutes ago, <laughs> I forgot. I've already forgotten everything about the game. Oh, oh yeah. Oh, it's this one. <laughs> it's fucking dry, 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 dry desert. So it's really all to play for. I mean, honestly, like, I think I'll just rage quit if I like, throw this race away. <laughs> I'd just be like, yeah, that's enough Mario Kart for me, ever, never again. In fact, you know what? I'm just done playing GameCube games. Selling my GameCube, well, I don't have a GameCube, selling my Wii. Still on the game to controller. Uh, it's really easy to just get sucked into the middle of that and then eaten by the big flower, which kind of sucks and loses you so much time. I think it pops you back at the start of the, the thing as well if you get eaten by it, so it's like a complete nightmare. Uh, looks like we're good. Looks like we're good. And it's a blue shell. Of course it is. Blue shell and a red shell. And uh, it's facing the wrong way for a moment there. That was weird. Oh, star power? This is weird that I'd get star power when I was only in uh, fourth place. Oh, of course, if you've got star power, star power does save you from getting, I forgot about that, star power saves you from getting hit by the blue shell, but it's like really rare that you can have star power in first place, so I guess they weren't that worried about it happening, but I guess if you've like, if you started off in a bad position and then like, yeah, just work your way back up. Um, and then get hit by a, by a blue shell. But then maybe that was the, the dev's way of saying, do you know what, if that happens, then fair play to you for earning your way from the bottom to the top without actually using the star power that we gave you. Oh man, another blue shell! Oh, oh, oh! Bad times. Three reds. Oh, this is a perfect place to have three reds. Oh, great. I was hoping to just knock him into the middle there, because, uh, yeah, then they get eaten by the flower. Oh, no! Get back here! <laughs> oh. I think, um, thir third place would throw this for me. Oh! Steals the win! Steals the win! Absolutely steals it. How much? How close was that? That was... <laughs> um, yeah, okay, so that's eight, eight, uh, that's 26. 26 milliseconds. <laughs> Stole it back for 26 milliseconds. That's good. That was, that's a fitting, a fitting end, I think. A fitting end to my, my ordeal my trials against uh, Mario Kart Double Dash. Uh, quite happy with that, quite happy to have um, got, got gold in all the, all the tracks. I wasn't expecting it, I thought that, um, well I thought I'd really struggle with the last one, but I got gold for like the first time, so that was alright. Um, 
Yeah, we were like Rainbow Road and stuff because it like just derails you right there. You know, you're having a good run and then it's Rainbow Road and you just get screwed over. Uh, no, it's gone swimmingly well. Um, and that's it. That's the, the last last gold cup that I needed. Congratulations, you've done it. You've got gold, 150 CC gold in every every race. All right, I don't unlock anything because I actually got gold in 150 CC when I was practicing this. So, uh, ah well. Anyway, on that note, um, this has been fun. Thanks for tuning in. Uh, if you're still watching, um, I'll be back. Um, as indeed I always am on weekdays, 1 p.m. playing uh, Mario Odyssey. Um, you can, I've just put a link in the chat. You can, you can vote there uh, for the next game that I'm gonna play once I've completed Mario Odyssey. I think I'm more than halfway through Odyssey now, so uh, it probably is in the next week or so that I'll be uh, moving on to the next game. So that's an exciting time. Um, thanks, thanks for that, Brufin. Yeah, yeah, uh, I've, I've had, I've had fun uh, not getting whooped by Mario Kart. Good times. And uh, yeah, I'll be back back at 1pm uh, 1pm UK time tomorrow playing more Mario Odyssey. So uh, I'll see you then. Thanks for tuning in.